My quest to make pants and shorts is still going strong. I've made three garments with crotches. <laughs> Boy, that's a funny thing to say on the internet. <laughs> anyway, two of them were jumpsuits and one was a pair of knit shorts and they are all three hanging proudly in my closet. So I thought it was high time to tackle some woven shorts. This is actually a pattern I've made before and the fit was terrible. In fact, it was so bad, I just went right ahead and donated them to Goodwill. They were too uncomfortable to even wear. The front between the waistband and the high hip was so baggy and the front leg was too tight. It was a pretty bad combo. For that version, I made a straight size 20 with no alterations. I just figured making the size that fit my hip width and then using the elastic back to cinch in at the waist would be fine. Spoiler alert, it's not. I like to learn things the hard way, okay? So when I set out to make this pattern again, I used the steps I recently learned to measure and adjust the crotch length, crotch depth, and crotch extension depth of the pattern. I ended up making adjustments to all three, mostly to the front pattern piece. I'll be sure to share this process with you guys as soon as I feel like I can confidently present the steps and answer any questions y'all might have about it. The fit of these shorts is still not perfect. The back rise needs to come up a little more. I didn't account for the elastic pulling down the center back when I made my muslins, and so now it's a little low. And the leg openings are still pulling to the back. When you look at the pattern cover though, the same thing is happening to the model's shorts. So I know it's just drafted this way, but do any of y'all know how to fix that? Do I just add some width at the hem of the front piece? Also, do you guys recognize this fabric? I used the same brocade from Joanne for my holiday dress a couple of years ago. I absolutely love it as shorts. It really does give me that fancy casual look I was going for. I will say though that brocade is a little itchy on the wrong side. I ended up making the waistband facing out of quilting cotton to help it be a little bit more comfortable. I'll be posting a tutorial on this bias tape facing finishing real soon, so stay tuned for that. And the rest of the seams are simply serged. On this day, I decided to pair my shorts with my new Nico top. Click the link in the top right corner of this video to see more about that make. I'll also put a link in the description box. Here's how you access the description box. This is such a fun outfit that I plan on wearing a lot more. I'll just throw on my white seamwork jean jacket as a layering piece, and I've got the perfect spring monochromatic look. But that's going to do it for me today. I hope you guys like my shorts. Let me know in the comment section below what you think. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you all very soon. Bye.